worked on it all week. The US trying to congest those areas centrally where they can cause a lot of damage. Make sure they're not outnumbered in there. Griezmann takes. It's not really dealt with by the US defence. Nobody won that header. It's come out to Paul Pogba. He'll be wanting to put on a bit of a show here today. He's been getting a few jeers from the French fans, and of course he's coming off a difficult season with Manchester United. Mbappe. Now Sidibe to cut it back. The right back who was ever present in the qualifying. US give it away. Pogba! Oh, it bounced off the post. He nearly scored there. And we go back to that sloppy giveaway from Julian Green and Weston McKinney. And Ian, you talk about tactically being disciplined. I also think you've got to show the ability to keep possession. And what we've seen in the first couple of minutes here is that the United States... City Bay is the supremely gifted Kylian Mbappe wearing the number 10 shot. Oh, that's a clever ball towards Giroud from Pogba. He looks up wanting the referee to get a penalty. He's not getting it. At some point, you've got to put pressure on Paul Pogba. No pressure whatsoever. Little clip ball over the top. Cameron Carter-Vickers does a good job of getting between that ball and Zach Steffen. Giroud Once again, Griezmann to take it. Giroud on the header and would have expected to score. You could tell from his reaction, he was disappointed not to do so. Well, Tim Parker gets caught coming too near, too close to that near post, so it's just a little back post run from Giroud. Here's Blaise Matuidi towards Giroud again. They always have that option with him in the team of getting in crosses. He is going to get so many chances, I think, at the World Cup, Giroud. Well, because all the eyes are going to be on the dynamic players in wide areas, Griezmann and Mbappe. Dembele, they have a wealth of riches in those wide areas, and it opens up a lot of 1v1 opportunities for Giroud getting on the end of crosses. Uh, Ireland, in fact, has been more prolific for the U.S. than he's been for his club Hamburg this last season. And Griezmann with a license to not only score, but getting space. Mbappe goes the other way, and Parker is able to cut it out. Is Mbappe again. Griezmann. But Tim Parker's done a good job in the first 20 minutes of reading that running behind. Yeah. But you've got to be a real smart tactical player to find those seams. Griezmann's that player. Griezmann with the cushion header down. Pogba flicked it on, hoping there was somebody at Manchester City and once he's linked up with the French squad. And they reckon he's ready to start this one. Lee. He's going to make them even better next season. Mbappe's little layoff. Oh, Mbappe and Griezmann are coming in, playing on both shoulders of Will Trap. So now he can't make one decision or the other to track Mbappe. It's off this man right here, Antoine Griezmann. And they haven't got a goal yet. They haven't broken through yet, which is a testament, really, to how concentrated these USA youngsters have been so far. Oh, Mendy's got him behind here. And Mbappe's gone to the near post! Between Shaq Moore allows a simple run from Mendy in behind. There's the Columbus Crew goalkeeper, Zach Steppen, being released, of course, for international duty. He's kept uh, five clean sheets in a row for his club. But City Bay into the path of Conte, who doesn't usually get that far up the pit, is Matt Miazga. By the way, at half-time today, we'll have an interview with the new general manager of U.S. Soccer, Taylor Twarman, has been talking to Ernie Stewart. And quickly played in towards Mbappe here. How quick is he, by the way? Almost Olympian speed. Matuidi, Pogba... Good effort from him. Wants a goal today, wants to cement his place. He knows about all the talk of Corentin Taliso of Bayern Munich. Well, Julian Green having to track back here, but a good cut from Paul Pogba. But it was the play earlier. Continue, I'd like to see him in Bundesliga for the following year.
I, I'd like to see him maybe move on. And, and listen, some people will shake their heads. He'll be playing in Europa League. This summer, by the way. Once again, Mbappe going through his party tricks, lays it back. USA defense all over the place for a moment, but they got the job done. And Miaski gives a little thumbs up back to Zach Stefan at the end of it all. Mendy, lovely ball. Griezmann's got space! Oh, and he didn't. You've always got to be aware of that space in behind. Because Tim Parker gets so caught up with that run in behind with Giroud, Griezmann finds that space. At Kylian Mbappe accelerating into space. Griezmann is Griezmann. Difficult task, I think, throughout the entire 90 minutes for this back line, especially for a young defender in Matt Miazga. Header on goal away. Pogba's release ball is in towards Griezmann, who got there first. And switched off again. He is. Pogba and hit the post early on. Griezmann! did well again there. Two yards in front of their goal area and try to push forward and maybe make it a little bit more compact for the French to play through. Quite important not to leave. Left out Lacazette of Arsenal. Could have picked Kevin Gamero as well. He didn't know France seek a breakthrough. Stefan got a fist to it. Wasn't He's in the game. He's involved. He's seen it, and then Eric Palmer Brown's coming into a difficult situation here. There is uh, Palmer Brown with the header as well. Only a second cap for the Manchester City youngster. He's heavily involved straight away. Dembele looking to make a big impression. He's one of those trying to force his way in. Tolisso's ball inside, and Mbappe looking to measure it. It's fantastic challenge from Carter Vickers. Hey. Nice turn, wasn't it? Mbappe crowded out this last part of the game. Pogba looks to Ben one, no problem for Zach Steffen. There's so many white shirts sitting on top of that 18. Very difficult for the French to find that half a yard. And if you're gonna give up an opportunity in these areas. Kylian Mbappe is going to take this for France. That's been an extraordinary story so far here. Keep an eye on Griezmann sitting right in front of Zach Steffen. Mbappe! Oh, it nearly curled in. First off, Eric Lehigh, if he wants to bolster that defense a little bit. Stretched out here. Easy run for Paul Pogba to blow by all three of them. Well, trap left with no decision but to foul. Free kick 30 yards out. Pogba fancies it. He wants it, doesn't he? So too does Fekir. Pogba. Extra stripe on his arm, I guess. Took precedence. And then from a long way, Lucas Hernandez. I think maybe the only reason he's come off is because he's been booked. Yedlin, of course, is the most experienced player. Fekir. Pavard. Mbappe, 1-1. France get their breakthrough at last. And the US's resistance is finally broken. Coming in here, laying a great ball off to Pavard. And look at that little half a yard run from Mbappe. It's off the blunt. Nabil Fekir to score here. And what is his farewell appearance? Maybe on this ground. And Zach Steffen makes a good save. Go back to that save from Zach Steffen. So a save he'd expect to make, but he did make it. Tyler Adams putting Joe Corona in. Do stay and well played again by Parker. Really cool. 
night four years ago preparing for 2014 World Cup when you watch Tim Parker is it off to say he ball again I think he got the big cheer because the Lyon fans now believe their hero's staying yeah but the one thing I've noticed since he's come into the game he's got the ability to break down defenders doesn't rely on his pace but more of his ability in tight areas yeah he's concerned it as well Lamar flashes across the face of goal that Stefan can be excused for taking his time over this. He's getting a few whistles from the French fans. He won't worry about that. Towards ticking his leg up, but Dembele has it now on the right-hand side. It will go behind and deflected wickedly, and Stefan had to perform some acrobatics to tip that over. Well, and this ball's whipped in. It looks like it hits Tyler Adams in the face. Great reaction here from... Against... Uh, very fresh-faced USA side. You would have to think, though, that head injury. Long-range shot from Fakir. Stefan had to make an important save. Dembele! But the second save was much better. You've got to be kidding me. Tremendous work from the goalkeeper. And Parker did a bit of covering as well in there. And the USA have pulled off what is really a remarkable result here. Bearing in mind the inexperience. There's the Stefan save. Dembele again, and then he makes another one. Yeah, but for someone that's that body frame, this save is one thing. But you've got to get up and react. Dembele hits that perfectly. That ball's behind Zach Stefan. We saw it last year in the MLS Cup playoffs. Time and time again for the Columbus Crew, Zach Steffen with a huge save.